In this video, we'll see how to do problem, practice problem 5 from Experience 5. After being rejected from employment, Kim Kelly learns that the Bellevue Credit Company has hired only five women among the last 17 new employees. She also learns that the pool of applicants is very large and an approximately equal number of qualified men as qualified women. Help her address the charge of gender discrimination by finding the probability of getting five or fewer women when 17 people are hired, assuming there is no discrimination based on gender. All right, so we want the probability that x is at most 5, I mean, x being less than or equal to 5, and uh, the probability that a randomly selected person is female is 0.5, because half of them are men and half are women. So the probability here is 50%. Right? And we're doing uh, 17 trials, and we're looking for the probability of at most 5. So we use the binome CDF that will give us the uh, adding up situation. I make the probability 0.5. Trials are 17. We're interviewing 17 people. And then x, you want it to add up from 0 up to 5. So that's the probability that you randomly pick 17 people, and at most 5 are women. Okay. So it's seven, eight decimal places, 0 0.071731567.4. And we can find this on Excel doing pretty much the same thing. Binome dist. The number of successes would be 5. Trials is 17. Probability of success is 0.5. And cumulative is 1. And if you need more decimal places, you can always get them. Like that. I believe we have more than eight anyway. Okay, so if the probability was less than 0.5%, um, then we would say it's a very unusual event, and we would have evidence that there is gender discrimination. Um, you can see that it's only a 7% chance of this happening, and that is not um, less than 0.5%. Right? Uh, it's 7 out of 100, so um, we would say no, this does not support a charge of gender discrimination. Right? It's uh, not likely, but it's also not unusual.